The aim of this coursework is to do seven different physical activities whilst the app activates sensors in the phone and saves the data of each type of activity. It is ideal to try and get at least two recordings of each activity for one or two minutes. When you open the activity tracking app, called Info 4120, this screen here will appear. You need to fill in the net ID with your UEA login, excluding the at uea.ac.uk part. First, you must select the name of the activity from this drop down menu that you're going to do. There are two buttons to start and stop the activity tracking. Press start when you begin and stop when you're finished. The app will automatically save a .txt file with your phone's IMEI number, date, activity type, net ID and sensor type in the file name. Later versions of Android may not have IMEI numbers accessible. If no number appears in the app screen, please contact one of the teaching staff. You will need to conduct two trials for each activity in the menu. When you're recording, place the phone securely in your pocket. Trouser pockets are recommended as they closely align to your leg motion. Try to make sure the phone is not too loose and doesn't move around in your pocket. The application will automatically discard the first and last two seconds of the recording to allow you time to get the phone in and out of your pocket. Remember to stop recording as you move between activities as you do not want to accidentally collect the wrong data. For stationary activities, you can stand in the lab. When recording on the stairs, try to avoid stairways that may be congested. If you're walking up or down multiple floors, briefly turning on flat landings is fine. When using the lifts, try to pick a time and place when they are not being used as to not inconvenience other people. Also, make sure the direction of the lift is correct and doesn't stop too long between floors. It may be hard to get a full minute of data for lifts in one direction. Don't worry if you don't get this, just get as much as you can. Make sure any walking or running activities are conducted outside on a flat surface where you're not going to get in people's way. And of course, never run indoors. Walk at your normal pace and running can be just a light jog. Remember to make a note of where you collected each set of data and where you put the phone at each of the recordings. This will be important for your report later. Once you have finished collecting data for a certain trial, it's important to check the data has been saved. You do not want to come back to the lab and have to go out again if there is an error in saving. You will find save files in My Files, Device Storage, ubicomp info4120. Check the right files are there with the right file names. Before you can analyse the data, you need to move it back from the phone to the PC. Connect it with a USB cable and select the folder with your data to copy to the PC. Put all the text files from your data collection into the designated OneDrive folder and name the folder by your UEA username.